What's going on guys, it's your boy J-Ho bringing you a brand new video and today I'm going to show you guys my Trials of Osiris rewards from this week on all three of my characters. So this week was the first week of Trials of Osiris returning in year two. The map was Bannerfall which I'm not the biggest fan of to be honest but it was still a pretty fun event. I always loved Trials in year one. It was a very fun competitive event for me and I enjoyed it a lot. It was a lot more competitive this time around based on the matchmaking that's what it seemed like to me and uh, it was pretty good overall I was able to get some decent rewards so I'm gonna show you guys what I get on all my characters I was able to make it to the lighthouse on all my characters so three times and I was able to get some good stuff as well as some good stuff from the tier bounties as well so let's get straight into it Starting off with my first character on my Warlock, from the Lighthouse Chest you are guaranteed an Adept version of one of the Trials primaries and it's also guaranteed to come in between 310 and 320. So alongside of the Lighthouse Emblem we got the Doctrine of Passing Adept at 312 and the Doctrine of Passing Auto Rifle is kind of bad. The stats on it aren't the greatest. It has the high fire rate, zero impact stats on the Auto Rifle and uh, those are always typically not the greatest types of auto rifles so I'll probably utilize that for infusion fuel if I can on something better and then going into the trials of Osiris bounties this is the way that you can earn your tier rewards this time around so you don't need to get wins in year two to earn your tier rewards all you have to do is pretty much participate in trials and then you can earn these bounties and you can get some pretty good stuff from this as well so from the bronze tier it's the same as last year you get your typical Mozart light and, and passage coins not strange coins and from the silver tier I ended up getting a heart of praxic fire and for the gold tier we end up getting nothing because my inventory was full uh, so we head over to the postmaster and uh, I was able to pick up another chess piece and this was the trials chess piece for my warlock so it's the wing sun vestments came in at 302 with discipline and strength and it's not the greatest it looks pretty similar to last year's one as well so I'll probably utilize that as infusion fuel um, on something else and my heart of practice fire by the way came in at 318 so that was pretty amazing I believe the silver tier is the only one that can give an exotic. I'm not sure if gold tier can give an exotic as well. Um, actually, the lighthouse chest and the silver tier can give an exotic or has a chance to give an exotic, and it comes in between 310 and 320. So that's pretty amazing. I believe that's the only way we can get some high level exotics uh, past 310 as of right now. So that's really good. Moving on to my next character on my Titan from the Lighthouse Chest, we ended up getting another Doctrine of Passing Auto Rifle and an Immolation Fist Exotic Gauntlets. So for the Doctrine of Passing, we got a 311, which was even worse than my previous one. So that was kind of unlucky for me. And for my Immolation Fist, it came in at 310. So I'm actually not sure. I'm guessing if you can get a 310 to 320 Exotic from your Silver Tier, I'm guessing that your Lighthouse one should also be between 310 and 320 because that makes sense since Lighthouse is the ultimate reward or the Lighthouse chest is the ultimate reward. So I guess I just got unlucky on that one as well because it came in at 310. And then going into my uh, tier rewards for my bounties for my Titan for the bronze tier, we we're able to get more passage coins and motes of light like usual. For the other two bounties, you're able to get legendary marks guaranteed. So it's pretty good. You can get up to 150 legendary marks per week if you do the bounties on all three of your characters. That's pretty good. That's equivalent to one weapon from a vendor. So that's pretty good. And then from the silver tier, I got no exotic there. We just got more passage coins and motes of light. And then for the gold tier, my random trials item ended up being a artifact so I got a 310 artifact and it's pretty much equivalent to the one that you can get from the Road to King's Fall quest line so I'm not sure if you can get higher than 310 artifact from that gold tier or from trials in general um, if you guys know anything about that you can let me know in the comment section down below I haven't heard anything about getting higher than a 310 artifact as of right now in the game so yeah and then finally on my last character on my hunter from the lighthouse chest we got something other than the auto rifle. We got the reflection, some adept pulse rifle, and some motes of light. So my 
Pulse Rifle came in at 316, which was pretty good. And it had Third Eye on it and Army of One, I believe. So uh, not bad. I wish I had Head Seeker, though, on it. And um, the stats look pretty decent on it as well. If it's anything similar to the Messenger from Year One, um, it should be a pretty decent weapon for uh, Trials or for Crucible in general. So yeah. And then ending off on my Trials bounties for my tier rewards for my Hunter, we were able to get the typical uh, Passage Coins and Motes of Light on the Bronze tier. For the other two bounties, you get your usual Legendary Marks, always good. And then for the Silver tier, we were looking for another exotic between 310 and 320 and we got one we got a graviton forfeit pretty lucky there and then my gold tier ended up being another reflection some post rifle so my graviton forfeit came in at 318 defense that was pretty solid so i got two exotics between 310 and 320 out of my silver tiers for the weekend pretty good there and my reflection sum was 305 and it came with the head seeker perk so pretty good that was one of the perks that made the messenger really good in year one. So I can't wait to try that one out as well. So pretty solid rewards for me this week. We got the pulse rifle. We got some exotics between 310 320. And we got some other adept weapons that I can use to infuse. So that's about it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys got. If you guys got some good rewards from trials this past weekend. I can't wait. To play more trials next weekend and get some more sweet stuff so let me know what you guys got in the comment section down below thank you guys for watching once again and i will catch you guys in the next one peace